Well, tonight, the Evansville Fire Merit Commission met to clarify the disciplinary actions for a fire inspector. Eyewitness News' Grace Habel is at that meeting for us. She joins us now with the latest on this. Grace? Brad and Shelley, Fire Inspector Chad Emsweiler is facing disciplinary action after using a racial slur during what he referred to as a joke. Now, that's according to Evansville Fire Department Chief Mike Connolly. Now, the commission first met to discuss this incident on January 14th, but tonight, it officially determined what penalties Emsweller will be facing moving forward. After allegedly using a racial slur, Fire Inspector Chad Emsweller with the Evansville Fire Department is facing disciplinary action. Moving forward, uh, this is what we have decided. Emsweller will not be demoted, but he will have to report to Chief Mike Connolly on a bi-weekly basis and report to the Fire Merit Commission once every month. The commission said Emsweller will also be responsible for reporting any instance of harassment within the department. I think it's very important that he's involved specifically because he understands the nuances of the department. He's been a 20-year-plus employee of the department. He understands the culture and what's going on within the department. I want him to be able to specifically um, help us to address some of the concerns and issues that lie within the department that are apparent. I think there's been a lot of conversation that's come up in this in the last two months. Unfortunately, we are in 2020 in a city where we put stickers saying he is for everyone on every single billboard and everything, that in 2020 we find ourselves having to do diversity training. During the meeting, Commissioner Vic took a moment to call attention to the fact that he is the only black commissioner on the board. I take what I do very seriously. Stating he just wants to do what's in the best interest of the city. I don't look at this as a black and white issue. I look at this as an issue and a concern, something that needs to be addressed. Emsweller has already served a five-day suspension without pay and will also face a one-year zero-tolerance probation period. There is not a date set yet for when these trainings will begin, but they have expressed interest in working with the International Association of Firefighters. Additionally, the commission says that they are looking into setting up a hotline for firefighters to um, let them know of any type of harassment or any other issues that they're facing. And exactly what kind of training are we talking about here? So a lot of that is still being discussed, but they did say that they want them to be face-to-face -face and personal and directly related to each of the firefighters and the instances that they will face. All right, Grace Haber, thanks for the update.